sidelines of the Asian meeting. In Valentine Laos, external affairs minister S. J. Shankar has called on to the Laos Prime Minister Sonik Se Singh Fenden and raised the issue of trafficking of Indian nationals through cyber scam centers in the Southeast Asian country and discuss the development, partnership and cooperation in the areas linked like defense and energy. He emphasized the urgency and securing their early return back home. Hundreds of Indians are reportedly trapped in these three countries, which have been the gangs of operating by cyber scams who lured them with enticing job offers. Now, Jay Shankar said in a post on uh, X that on Saturday, during his call with the Prime Minister of Lao, PDR, he took up the issue of the trafficking of Indian nationals through cyber scam centers. He added that he appreciated the ongoing cooperation of Lao PTR and the government in the rescue and relief of the citizens. He also, in fact, discussed the matter with the foreign ministers of Cambodia and Thailand. Jay Shankar is in the capital of Laos, People Democratic Republic, to participate in the meetings of the Association of South East Asian Nations. Joining me on this broadcast at this uh, given story is my colleague Arzu. Arzu, uh, what we are picking up at this point of time that a call has been made and initiated by External Affairs Minister Jay Shankar as far as the trafficking of Indians is concerned to Laos and definitely the efforts are underway as the conversation hints. What more details can you share with us? Yes, Simran. Uh, in fact, the cyber crime activities have been increasing a lot in the Southeast Asia, and that's why, uh, you know, on the sideline of the Asian meeting of Laos, external minister S. J. Shankar held a slew of meeting with the counterparts from Laos, uh, Cambodia, and the Thailand on the issue of trafficking of Indian uh, citizens through cyber scam centers, and uh, you know, sought their early return. And also, hundreds of Indians are believed to have been stuck in the three countries uh, with gangs running. Cyber Cyber scam will lure them uh, to lucrative uh, job offers. Also during, uh, you know, uh, the, on the, during my call on the Prime Minister of Leo PDR uh, took up the issue of the trafficking of the Indian national through cyber scam centers. This is what the S. Shankar uh, tweeted, uh, you know, uh, has posted on Twitter and in fact uh, appreciate the ongoing cooperation of the Leo PDR government in the rescue and relief of our citizens. Uh, he also, in fact, mentioned that they have also discussed the matter with the foreign minister of Cambodia and Thailand. And, uh, you know, uh, also, meanwhile, over the 500 staff Indian citizens have been rescued from the country so far. The number is so big. And, in fact, even as there is no official number on how many more are stuck. And last week also, you know, 13 Indians were rescued uh, from cyber scamming centers in Laos as per the Indian embassy uh, a statement and uh, earlier also, you know, uh, several times the Minister of External Affairs had issued a warning to the Indian nationals about the growing threat of Indian traffickers uh, uh, luring individuals uh, with false promises of high paying jobs in the Com Cambodia and Southeast Asia. And also, victims are often forced in, into crime, cyber crime activities upon arrival. Uh, so, this is uh, now the action is being taken to protect the Indian uh, uh, Indian people there in the Cambodia and the Southeast Asia. Yes. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon.